David Cameron has dropped the vote on bombing Syria. This is a guy who is a poppy photoshopped onto a shirt. And the thing is, without another enemy we've never ever met, we're gonna notice what a complete moron he is. If we were at war, his photoshopped shirt wouldn't even made the papers. It'd be bad for morale. So, if it's not gonna be Syria, we have to find another country to fight. And how do you start a war? With lies about other countries to dehumanize their population. So, let's get to it. The country Iceland is suing the shop Iceland because of their association with Peter I Andre. Iceland the country thinks Iceland the shop is tarnishing the name Iceland. Do you think we should deport all of Icelanders to let everyone know? I'm assuming you're going to say bomb Iceland. <laughs> Not the shop, the country. We couldn't bomb the shop, there's too many. No, there's too many shops. Yeah, there'd be a lot of bombs to drop. Yeah, there's a lot of bombs, there's only Iceland is one country. So yeah, we could bomb Iceland, screw them. I don't like that. Are you from Iceland? Hope you're not. I'm not from Iceland. Well, that's all right then. <laughs> now what I would do, I'd let more Icelanders in and deport Peter Andre. Okay, that is an angle. Yeah, that's what I would do. Get rid of him. Maybe be bomb Peter Andre. Yeah, get rid of him. In Saudi Arabia, they've recently banned women from eating peanut butter. How do you feel about that? Peanut butter? Yes. Well, Don't you think we should fight for women's rights to have peanut, peanut butter? butter? Yes, peanut what? butter. Peanut butter is not really nice. I think you should fight for rights for women to be able to say their opinion and uh, be politically correct or not What if their opinion is they want they peanut want butter? We need to bomb these people. I love peanut butter. It's one of the best things ever. There needs but to be some kind of drone strike. A drone strike? Yes. How would you do that? You, you use a drone and you strike. Yeah, I think that's the only possible solution, to be honest. I don't think it's about the peanut butter. I don't think it's ever about the peanut butter. It always pretends to be about the peanut butter, but then it ends up being something completely different. Did you know in Canada it's legal to have sex with a beaver? No, I didn't know that. Have you done that yet? Do you want to have sex with a beaver? I don't want to have sex with a beaver just because I'm a Canadian. You, what are you, you racist? Are you Canadian? Yes. Oh, really? Do you think people should blow themselves up to stop the beaver beavers? from being hurt. Well, that's if the, if the Canadian Sorry. government doesn't allow it. That's the only they allow it. We need to stop them. We need to attack Canada. Yeah, then we should. Well, the Canadians get up to all sorts of things, don't they? I don't, what? Very long, very long dark nights. You know, they've got to find something to do, really. I would bomb for beavers. That's a good saying right there. That's your new political campaign, bomb for beavers. Powerful stuff there. Overall, Bobby, would you say the British public are a bloodthirsty race? Well, Sam, they want to start war with my country. I'm now regretting what I've done. And none of this would have happened if they just took a picture of David Cameron with a real poppy on. It's easier to take a picture than it is to Photoshop anything. Like, how do you use Photoshop? What the fuck is a layer?